yay animated short is it gonna be english voiced actually i'm curious will it be english voiced no it's not oh they've still not fixed it that's a shame all right no that should sort that then oh great alarms <laughs> Oh, hi, Jiggy Rat. Then, nah. Oh, the cat. We get to see Mimi. She is so fast. What? Yeah, he's just like, nah. No chance. Oh, <laughs> Cute. This poor guy. He's so out cold and she's just so ready. <laughs> Uh. Rip. Yeah, boy's preparing her food. Nice. That appetite, Jesus. Okay, hi. Oh! Oh, look, boy. Okay. Oh, okay. This poor guy. It's her. Ten minutes. Oh god. Yeah, nah. Yeah, I think I prefer Jing Yuan's approach. I'd be tired too. This. This girl. My god. Alright, let's go. Uh, yeah, all right, sure. Those are mine. <laughs> She's gonna kill you. What the? Yeah, that's an interesting logic behind it. Let's go. Kill him. We know the people are gonna stare at that. Okay. Yeah, I see what Su Shang meant about the comparison between the generals. If you were used to having someone up. <laughs> Rest in pieces. She's a minute late. Okay. Oh, you're used to fox cooking, aren't you? Hey. Our guy. Dead. <laughs> well played, Fox. Well played. Anything else? Nope. Ah, oh, <laughs> I love this approach, and I love that we actually get to see this poor man's morning routine. <laughs> I love the comparison of the two generals presently staying there, and I love that we get to actually see Mimi. She's so cute, man. And yes, we know the name of the cat because of his journal that he keeps. Oh my god. Cute. Just cute. <laughs> Meanwhile, she's so well sorted. He's just like, I need time. So it wasn't the boy who prepared her food. They prepared a nice place for her at least. It does look nice. As she, as they you know would, but still. This 
this girl's fun. I love her. She's great. I'm gonna probably at least try to get her home, but if I fail it, I fail it. I can't. <laughs> I can't risk the savings too much. I, I've just gotten another fifty-fifty attempt. That's all I've got. <laughs> And if I don't get more than that, then that's unfortunate. Next patch, I fortunately do get to save through because I have no interest in getting Rapper home. The following few, I'm hoping I get more save attempts, but I'm also not trusting Mahoyo enough for that, to be honest, with some of the panners that they've released simultaneously knowingly. Uh, like, for example, we've got both Topaz and Robin running in this patch with a, with a new follow-up main dps it's they're doing it on purpose they're being quite rough to people and there's nothing i can do about that <laughs> it's like with acheron and with the build on the fox they ran him and sparkle together both characters that would be used on acheron's team comp it's just like how do i win in that situation i can't i have to pull on both if i can they're doing that now, it seems, very commonly. And they're making some of the best five stars have either terrible four star options themselves, like Huahua had a god awful set of four stars with her, and they're baiting certain banners where you can maybe potentially avoid the light cones by making the four star options actually really good on them. It's concerning they're doing really well with using what they've got to push people to pull and that's obviously it's what they should be doing it's beneficial to the business just god is it rough god is it rough but yeah uh, i appreciate the fox i'm interested in a story i'm interested in her views on certain characters it's very funny to see her basically go to work on the law <laughs> It's like a part of me kind of hoped it would be a comparison showing her life on her own ship, but it makes sense that they wouldn't do that since may as well hold on to the surprise of that. Because you could compare their day-to-day -day routine, but then you won't be able to have them just casually meet this way. So it's fun that they're using the law foo. To show the different attitude of the actual residing general and just one who's taking a visit here and how they run things. <laughs>